My brain's getting sucked out now. But buffet girl, eight days a week. Eight days a week. I love you. Yeah. Eight days a week. I got a match. Oh. Where you going? I thought I was gonna go up there for a while. something that will not get out to the party you'll know who it should not get out to <laughs> if you I know what that means <laughs> sure I can do that you know what I'm sure say. sure I know what that means <laughs> I hear where you're coming from <coughs> let's pick it up sure no, as, as I recall we were about to state something in words that's never been stated before that's right and to do this, we shall turn down the sound. The stereo. Now, this is a statement about life, which shall be stated as deeply as I can think of it. Deep into the deepest part of my mind, I will think deep and think. <laughs> into the canyons of your mind. <laughs> <laughs> I will wander through your brain. <laughs> okay, now. Here we are. Here goes the beginning. This is it. We are on in the middle of the whole entire universe. The universe of USA in the United States of Universe, right? In the universe. There's nothing in it except you see stars and there's like planets around it but there's millions and millions and millions of them right so much that I don't even know if it ends or not it just goes on I just can't see anymore after a while even with the naked of the eye of telescope they just keep looking and they can't so what are the chances of it that in some small speck in the universe just a mere just a mere one such a small scale compared to the universe that it's not even measurable or thought about being measurable. There'd be so many decimal, point, decimal points and zeros before you get to think about <laughs> decimal points. the size of the earth to the universe and what's the chances of it being life on it and being intelligent life and people doing just what we're doing right now on it. What are the chances of that with things like foam rubber and the uh, red naga hide and lights around us talking and getting high. What's the chance of something like this happening and anywhere someone else? someone sitting around partying thinking Certainly if there's anyone like us. Tonight, and Beatles music, Beatles yeah. So far. I sure am and uh, well we haven't quite got to answer that. Our way up to the <laughs> Let's sure. see if you can so answer that. Point for the game. Okay. So we got lots more Beatles music yes. to go tonight. <laughs> yes. Doc Ross. That's it. Yes. Yeah. We answered everything. <laughs> I always thought about that. Yeah. I guess I kind of thought about that too for a while. But what's your hypothesis of life? I mean, like, what do you think it is? Do you think that it's a, a spirit that lives in a body for a while? Just to lose itself and goes back to where it was? Or, it, or the spirit may never be around, but it takes two people to create a spirit. Like it took my mother and father. It took two spirits to make this spirit here. But maybe I would never have 
gotten a chance to be around in the physical world if those two didn't get together. But I did. But maybe there's millions of others that never have or never will. But since the beginning of time, there's been millions of people and living things that have been able to see what it is to not be spirit. To be in the material world. There's only one North American underwriter. But it comes and it goes. Call 243 9545. That's 243 9545. Out of town. Those great concepts can only be summed up in much North American underwriters can save you. Give me liberty or give me death. That's what Nathan That's what Nathan Hale said. Is that Nathan Hill said that? Yep. Uh, I, I didn't think that was. I was going to say Nathan Hill because I thought it was funny because I didn't think he was one that said it. And I have, I have all those people to guess. I had to guess the right ones. And I didn't even know it. That's just my luck. Wow. A commercial must be over. Commercial time. Is it? <laughs> Say it. <laughs> we'll be back. What's that? It's, it's a vine. Do I look like a good? Okay. okay, we'll have a little intermission, then we'll get back to the the cosmic entities of but sophisticated. If you have a thought, please say. Who said it before you forget? If, um, whatever it is, like, whatever our reason for being here, you know, and no matter what you find if you go in that direction for the rest of your life, you know, no matter why that's out there, the reasons for everything, it's, it's too hard to comprehend. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Even under the influence of great mind thinking thing. <laughs> devices. Wow! It just, it was an intermission. This stuff has made me do some really incredibly deep thinking. That's not the first time I thought about stuff like that. It's just, it's all incredible, you know? It's so incredible. And the thing is, if you don't think about it now and then, you don't know how incredible it is and you're part of it. Yeah. You lived your life and you died. You've been a nowhere man your whole life. And you didn't even, you didn't even, you thought you had nothing, but you don't know how great it is that it's to be here, because it's so remarkable. You got memories and you got friends and, and and they go, what's the meaning of it all? Yeah. What's the meaning of life? Life is just living. It's just living. You want to enjoy it? You've been given. Yeah. You've been given a life. A life. Either if you want to live it, have a good time. If not, you had a bad time, but you had your life. You had the option to do with it what you please. Yeah. So that's why you shouldn't. Do what you don't want to do. Live your life unnaturally as a puppet or a slave. 